don't know, Liam published a book back in March, and he did all the all that uh, crayon work drawings himself. <laughs> oh, the crayons, yes, yes. Actually, it's a wonderful book called The Mountain of the Women. What? And uh, they have them on sale. It's called The Mountain of the Women, not The Mounting of the Women. I said, I said The Mountain. That's the sequel. There's about okay. ten of them left over in the store the down there. CD booth is over there. We also have CDs over there. So if any of you want to get a book or CD, that's the place to go before they take them away. But we're going to sing the song. Uh, are you going to do the... Finnegan's Wake first? No. <laughs> yes, I will. My friend Jimmy wrote this. Uh, now that we're co-authors, you see, I can call him Jimmy. Jimmy Joyce. But I'd like to recite it backwards because he liked it better that way. <laughs> There's where first we pass through grassy hush, the bush to wish you gone. Gulls, far calls coming far, and hear us then fin again. Take but softly, remember me, till thousands see the keys to given away, alone, a loved, a last, a long. The River run, past even Adams from swerve of shore, to bend of bay takes us by a commodious vitus of recirculation, back to Holt Castle and environs, and big Mr. Finnegan of the stuttering hand, three man's more or lived in the broadest way of marginable, in his rush lit too far back from estuages, before Joshua and Judges had given us numbers, or Helvidicus had committed Deuteronomy. During the odd years, this man of hot cement and edifices in Topers Thorpe, by the Bildung, Supra Bildung, upon the banks of the livers for the sown souls, a woolworth of a skyscraper of most Eiffel height, entirely originating from next to nothing, with a burning bush above of its bobble top, and with Lawrence O'Toole's as clittering up, and Thomas a bucket stuttering down, and the first was he to bear arms, and a name was a Libuzel. For Singapore. Oh, Mr. Finn, you're going to be fine again. Aha, Mr. Fun, you're going to be Mr. Finn again. But Jim, Jim, he stuttered from the ladder, and damn, he was done. Tim Finn, walking street, a gentleman. 